everybody. It's time for day 28 evening devotional. Hope you have your prayer journals and your Bibles, of course. So let's go ahead and open up in prayer. Get our hearts right before the Lord. You ready? All right. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this day. And uh, we just pray, Lord, that during this time you reveal what? We're praying, dude. Here, you want to sit with me? Pray that you bless our hearts, Father, that you encourage us with this word, Lord, and you give us exactly what we need to hear. We love you. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, so day 27, we're reading out of Blessings for the Heart. Yeah? Okay, you can get down. All right, so today's devotional is called Call to Minister. Whatever you do, work at it with all your heart. At working for the Lord, as working for the Lord, not for men. Colossians 3.23. Ministry is for everyone. It's not just a calling for pastors, missionaries, and evangelists. Many years ago, God chose a woman named Miriam to be a prophetess and worship leader, helping her brothers Moses and Aaron in bringing the people of Israel out of their slavery in Egypt. God miraculously allowed the people to walk through the Red Sea on dry ground and then caused the waters to wash away the pursuing Egyptian army. After the saved crossing, Miriam led worship and all the women followed her with tambourines and dancing. Miriam sang to them, sing to the Lord for he is highly exalted. The horse and its rider he has hurled into the sea. Effective ministry is not based on our abilities. We don't make it happen ourselves. We partner with God through prayer and he provides the power. One of the best ways we can minister to others is by praying for them. It's not always easy, but it's always worth it. When we pray for our ministry, we can ask God to give us the willingness and compassion to serve others. If we are not sure where to spend our time, we can ask God to help us identify our spiritual, our spiritual gifts and to use them effectively. I love you guys. Hope you have a great evening and we will see you back here tomorrow. Bye.